Yes, well, it's a great place and it is very unique, as you say. It's certainly the biggest and best tramway museum in the UK. I mean, we've got nearly 80 trams totally in the collection. It's absolutely unique in the things that we've got. But moreover, it's a nice sort of family atmosphere. It's just the right size. Here, everybody knows each other and we do refer to it as a family. When we first started here in 1959, it was literally a few old trams covered in tarpaulin sheets. It was about three or four years before we actually ran a tram at all, and it probably ran for a hundred yards. And that was really sort of hardcore tram enthusiasts. We recognised, however, if we wanted to turn it into a, an attraction, it would have to look like the period scene. So then we set the plan out, and actually the plan that we still stick to was done in the 60s, in terms of what buildings we would have where, what the um, look would be, you know, the time period that's in the sort of 1920s it's set for. So we're very strict guidelines that we set and so we'll just keep working on that. Stand clear please. Hold tight please. Yes, it's interesting here because we're running period trams but obviously we have to stick to the rules and regulations that are current in today's legislation so the rules we have to follow dictated by the office of rail and road is the law we have to follow but within that we have to do period looking activity so for instance in the morning we decide which trams we're going to run then the crews will come out here and prepare the trams and they have to go through a detailed checklist you know pre-flight checks as i like to call them Yes, obviously the star of the show are all the trams, so we, um, we keep them as if they would have been at a certain point in their life. And that's quite interesting because on a tram that, say, lasted for 40 years in service, we have to pick a particular time and display it. So we try and keep it looking as absolutely traditional as we can because it's basically an, um, an entertainment place of entertainment. I like to uh, meet the visitors, talk to the visitors, give the people a good time. It's nice to do a job, albeit not paid, where you are giving people a nice day out and people are thankful and they're very happy to, to be here. So I like to see that with you and it's nice to have a job where people have got a smile on their face.